Hey everyone, it's me Ollie from Retaliate, and today I'm going to be showing you guys a glitch which allows you to get your phone on any island. So you can also get unreleased items with this glitch, and it's found by Physio Ninja, so a huge shout out to him. So we'll load into creative in a minute, but before we load into creative, I'd like to thank everyone for 20,000 subscribers. We just hit 20,000 today, so a huge shout out to everyone for getting me to that number. And the next goal now is 30,000, so hopefully we can hit that in the next few months, that'll be amazing. But thanks to everyone that's been supporting the channel. Also, if you're not using my support to create a code yet, make sure to go to the item shop, press into support to create and type in Retaliate, and renew after 4 days. Anyway, let's get straight into the glitch. So we're going to be loading into creative mode for first. So once you're in creative, all you're going to do is you're going to head to your island, but make sure it's an island you don't care about because we're going to be doing a glitch and it might mess up the island a bit. So I'm just going to load into a block. So once you're in the island, all you want to do is you want to respawn and you're going to see when you respawn, you'll be in a certain location and we're going to be doing the glitch. This is an old one to get back to the creative of your phone. So we're going to be doing that and this was found by Physio Ninja as well. All we're going to do is we're going to double tap the second we respawn. We're going to stay in the exact same position and we're going to fall down. So once you're at the ground, all you're going to do is you're going to build up and you're going to build to the height limit. Now as you can see we are at the high limit and all you want to do is you want to go into your inventory and you want to get this prefab here so it's in the prefabs and it's close to the bottom and you just want to copy this and you're going to throw it down. So once you've thrown it down you want to copy this and you want to enable resizing and make sure you turn off drops. You just want to press into G and then you're going to resize it so you're going to make it as big as you can and now you're just going to place as many as you can whilst you're going down so I'm going to try and place quite a few. You don't have to go all the way to the bottom but you just want to place quite a few just to make sure. So it needs to look a bit like this make sure you've got quite a lot so when you respawn you are back in the creative hub. So once you've done this you can test it so you can try respawn. So I'm going to try respawning now to see if I go back into the creative hub. If not, we're going to try it again. So as you can see, it did work and I do have my phone. So now we're going to be moving on to the next part of the glitch and we're going to be changing the island settings. So you're going to go back to your island. Right, so we're back on that island and I know there might be quite a lot of steps, but it is worth it at the end of the day because you will get unreleased items and stuff like that. So all you want to do, I'm going to pop up on screen now what you want to do to your island settings. But basically, you want to press into my island and you want to change a lot of these. So I'll pop them up on screen now. So these are what you have to just set them to. So once you've configured all your island settings, all you want to do is start the game. Once the game starts, you just want to go on the pause menu and you want to press into respawn. Now once you respawn, you should be in the creative hub, so let's see if it works. Yeah, and there we go, we are in the creative hub. Now you want to aim towards the rift and we're going to auto run. And whilst we're auto running, we're going to go on the pause menu, press into my island and we're going to press into end game. And then the second we go into the rift, you want to wait until you see the black screen. And then once you see the black screen, you're going to press into return to island. So you need to wait for the black screen, make sure you don't press it before or else you'll mess it up. And make sure you don't press it a few seconds after or else you'll mess it up as well. So the timing might seem difficult, but it's not. So we're going to aim towards the rift, we're going to press into auto run, go on the pause menu, my island, end game, and the second it turns black, we're going to press into restart island. So there we go, hopefully it worked this time. And you're going to see you will teleport back here. And now all you want to do is if you teleported back here, so I think it has worked, and all you want to do is you're going to head back to the island and you want to wait until you get your phone. So we're just gliding down now. There's no rush now. You can just wait until you get your phone. And as you can see, we've got it now. All you want to do is you want to go on the pause menu, press into back to creative hub. And as you can see, we've not got a phone now. However, if this glitch works, you can get your phone in any island and you're going to see in a few seconds it should appear. So hopefully it will appear. Let's just wait. And there we go, it has appeared. So now we've got a phone. You can actually access the inventory, so you can use it to cheat games and stuff like that and spawn stuff. And you can also go into some of these rifts here and get unreleased items. So what I did do is I've made a code full of unreleased items. Physio Ninja helped me get these items, so a huge shout out to him. But basically, it has a battle bus. So as you guys do know, they did patch the battle bus glitch, you know, to get the battle bus, and you can't get it now. They've put this one here. So if you never had the chance to get it, you can get it again now. You just have to use my island. If you're a YouTuber and you're gonna copy the island, don't. Make sure you give me and Physio Ninja credit. So um, don't just go and steal our island and create your own and take credit for it because that's not fair. Anyway, I'll put the code in the description and you just want to select the island. Right, so as you can see, it's loaded here and I'm going to be showing you guys now the method to get any item into your island. So we're going to be going into the rift and once you're in here, you're going to see we have these huge W's and basically these are unreleased. So these were in some featured maps and for some reason they had permission to it and they had access to it before anyone else. So you can get these huge W's before they're even released. You can get big ones, you can get small ones, you can just resize them. You've also got the battle buses so if you did miss these and you missed the opportunity to get them with this glitch you now can get them so everyone thank Fizzy Ninja for this because he made this possible again you can get these gold flags as well and these are from the actual main island however I think these are on some featured maps so you can also get these so I'm gonna be showing you guys how to get all of them and it's really easy so we're gonna be doing the glitch to select stuff with our pickaxe and all you want to do is you want to select the stuff that you want to get so I'm gonna select this you're gonna press it to R so we're gonna be using multi select so I've selected this then I'm gonna select the battle bus as well and I'm gonna select this flag so as you can see I've got all three now and all you want to do you want to select your pickaxe and then a millisecond later press into select as if you're going to copy it right so i've got everything selected i'm going to swap to my pickaxe and try and copy 
So as you can see we've done it now and we do have our pick outs and we've got everything selected. So all you need to do now is you want to head to the rift. So as you can see there's a rift here. If you're doing these in featured maps and you're trying to copy stuff from there, you may have difficulties trying to find the rift. So you have to do the method where you go on the pause when you swap to the pickaxe as well. Anyway, all you need to do is the second you go into the rift, you want to spam onto place. So that's left click for me. So I'm going to go in the rift and spam place. So as you can see we've done it and we've got the huge W here and we've got the battle bus and we've also got the flag somewhere. So you've got the flag as well here. So if you want to get this to your main island now, all you need to do is you want to go back to your main island and you want to make sure that nothing's covering the spawn pad. So you want to make sure you've got a spawn pad placed down. So I'm going to go to this block island here and this is the one that we started the glitch on and all we're going to do is we're going to drop down and we're just going to put down a spawn pad. And it only does work if you have one of these placed, it won't work if you don't. So this is a crucial step, you do need to put down a spawn pad otherwise it won't work. So as you can see we've got one down here and we're just going to return to the hub again. So once you return to your hub you're just going to wait a few seconds for your phone to appear again and this is a good thing with this glitch a lot of you guys may have had this glitch you know when you were just playing creative normally and we don't know yet what triggers it but fizzy ninja did find out how to recreate it every single time which is this glitch so you shout out to him so we're going to copy everything now so we're going to copy this golf thing here we're also going to copy the battle boss and the huge w we're going to be doing the pickaxe glitch now so we're going to swap to the pickaxe and copy so as you can see you've done it now and all you want to do is you want to head to your rift and the second you go into your rift you're going to spam so you're going to spam please and there we go, we've done it. So you may have pasted them quite a few times, so you can delete a few if you want. But as you can see, we've got a huge W here. We can actually resize it and stuff, so we can make it small if we want. And these are really sick, so you can also get the battle bus. We've got the battle bus now, and you can resize these as well. So if you want to make a huge battle bus, you can. And I hope you guys do appreciate this. Fizzy Ninja has been spending a lot of time trying to find glitches, and he's found an amazing one now. And we've also got the golf flag here, so you can also resize these as well. So I hope you guys did enjoy this. If you're new here, make sure to subscribe. We just hit 20k, so our next goal now is 30k. If we can reach that in the next few months, that'll be amazing. And huge shout out to Fizzy Ninja. I can't thank him enough for this glitch. It's actually amazing. So if you are going to re-upload this, make sure to give credit. And that is it for today's video. There'll be a glitch compilation coming soon of 10 brand new glitches. And I'll see you guys in the next video. Goodbye.